positive through to the next round of the cup, Ross. Is it good to get some positivity back around the ground after some disappointing results? Yeah, obviously we've uh, we've had some disappointing results in the league, and, and we've not um, we've not been good enough in the, in terms of that. So like the big thing we wanted to do was was sort of like move on, uh, react, and um, we have done today. Although like uh, we weren't especially great in the first, well, we weren't especially great across the whole of the game, but but we've managed to get there and we're through and went and sort of in the next round, but. Um, I don't think it was the it was the best performance, and and probably like we 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 got booed off like a couple of times, and I think we probably would have deservedly got booed off for that performance in the first half. So um, it is nice to win, like winning winning is obviously a good habit, and like it's nice to see what that feels like because we've not we've not had that in a while. But but like I said, the performance wasn't the best. Uh, you say obviously the performance wasn't the best. Do you think it just came down to a big gap in class between us and Leicester today? Um, I mean, obviously we've got better players, and, and ultimately that's what, what sort of won us the game. I think like it's hard um, to. They're awful games, like in terms of um, getting yourself up for it. But you should be obviously professional footballers. But you always find that bit of like where you where you where you're obviously the favourites. Like you're obviously expected to win, and it, it, it's not enjoyable because like you, you, you that, that little bit of pressure on you. And I've not massively enjoyed that game, but we got through. Where, and off we go and, and we're into sort of the last 16 which not the quarter final the last 16 yeah uh, obviously at the end of the day a win's a win do you think this is like the start of a turnaround we can put some momentum going forwards yeah hopefully I think I mean even though we've still made a mistake there which obviously isn't good enough and, and um, we, we, uh, we I think we've played a bit too slow at times our tempo of our play needs to be a lot better and we play forward a lot quicker um, but yeah I think hopefully like I've always said this group are, are always going to be inconsistent and, and they're going to put some wins together and then not put some wins together and, and, and you never quite know when it's going to turn the corner but um, I'm obviously always confident going to Solly Hall and like I think one of the one of the big difficulties you've got with this competition is is obviously we've not got the more biggest squad and, and you can probably see I've got sort of five eight eight year olds on the bench and a goalkeeper um, so like we're, we're carrying a lot of players and, uh, and we're, we've got a lot of players cup tied so then going into Solly Hall sort of doesn't help things really. Obviously still a way to go but do you think we'll start dreaming of Wembley yet? Um, I think it's obviously one game at a time, and that's the most important thing. Um, we've got to pick our league form up. Like that's 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 absolutely a must. Like we're we're not winning in the league at the minute, and, and that's 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 really disappointing. And, and the boys are really disappointed with it. And, and we've got to start putting some some results together in the league. And um, of course, we want to do well in this competition. It does it does have its drawbacks in terms of like like I said, like the numbers and the bodies and tiredness and whatnot. But um, and it is a cram cram sort of January, but. We'll get through it, and, and 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 we'll get through it the best we can. But of course, we wanna we wanna try and go as far as we can. I think I think uh, I said I, I said this, obviously we've never been to Wembley before in the history of this club, and what a great opportunity for the boys to, to sort of cement their their status as sort of in the history books of this football club. <laughs> Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.